Hi, I'm Thelma. Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new. Today I am I have for you a Dollar Tree haul. It's a health and beauty product, some cleaning supplies, and new makeup. A lot of this stuff is new that I haven't seen before. And so these are new high-end finds and um, some of the stuff that I if I've hauled it before if I remember that I did, then I'll go ahead and tell you that it's been there before. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, first, I've never seen this at the Dollar Tree before, but it's um, Suave Essentials Sun -ripe Ripened Strawberry Energizing Shampoo and Conditioner. Now these are a 15 full ounce bottle, 24 hour fragrance, and it's, let's see, infused with strawberry extract and vitamin E, and it's a new bigger size, and as you know, it's only a dollar. So as you can see, there's everything that I told you, and this stuff smells awesome I mean it is oh you can smell the, the ripened strawberries and it it makes me even though I'm allergic to strawberries it makes me want to go eat a strawberry right now <laughs> okay let me smell the conditioner oh it's not as strong as the shampoo but it's you can you can smell it and if you buy and use both products I guarantee you're gonna love the results so there's that and there's this is a bonus 25% uh, percent free versus a 12 ounce bottle of white rain it's moisturizing body wash lavender escaped um, moistures nourishes and protects and it's a 15 ounce bottle and it, and um i think i told you it's lavender escape yes oh and it smells just like the flowers oh i love it okay now this i know is new too and i had to go to two um, Dollar Trees, the one local here in Paris, Kentucky, and the one in Winchester. And this came from the one in Winchester because my uh, Dollar Tree is normally, they, they get things in, but not um, a lot of stuff. It says it's not available in this region. And so I had to go to Winchester, Kentucky, which is only 20 minutes up the road from where I live. Now this is called Slumber, uh, here is the Body Wash and Foaming Wash, Smoothing Lavender, and then here's the uh, Body Lotion. I looked and I didn't see any shampoo or conditioners of it. They also had another one. Um, I'm going to take use these when I take my showers at nighttime because sometimes I take one at night and then one in the morning and um, I thought with slumber it's probably to help get you relaxed and um, so you can sleep better well I'm going to the body wash and foaming wash I'm going to take the lid off and smell it and see what the scent is oh my that smells real good it's you can smell that lavender and it's not as strong as the the body wash that I showed you in the white rain it's, it has a different scent to it and I like this one better and this is the body wash and foaming wash and as you can see it's a 14 ounce bottle and this is what it looks like. I love the 
the container. It's a uh, clear purple. As you can see that, you can uh, see where you can almost see through and see the body wash in there. But I had to, when I seen these, and this is a 10 full ounce of the body lotion. Now when I seen these, I had to get them because uh, how do you know they're not going to get them in again? It might be one of them things where you, they just get them in that one time and that's it. I'm smelling the the lotion now. Oh my. I love it. Now you could use some use the the body wash and foaming wash and then get you some kind of shampoo and conditioner that's lavender and then with the lotion and uh, you'll be smelling real good then. Okay, and I am a coconut fanatic. I mean, anything coconut, I love it. I've, I've made coconut cookies before. I've made uh, coconut cakes. Um, uh, if it can be made, or if it's something like a candle or this uh, hand soap, it's called Coconut Cocoa Hada, and... It smells, I've never seen this one there either, but it smells, oh my. And this is one too, like, just like the strawberry one, it made me want to go eat. This may, may, makes me want to go get something that has coconut, like a donut with coconut. <laughs> I, I love coconut. And I'm just so happy I'm not allergic to it. I can eat as much as I want. Okay, to go on, here is Spa Naturals Luxury Collection. There's three bath bonds, and it's Lavender Dreams. I don't remember seeing these there either. And a C. Here's another thing of bath bombs. They're smaller, but there's three. And these are coconut oil and sea salt and let me open it and I'm going to, these are small but I want to show you how big big well or small they are and they're each individually wrapped in uh, plastic this is how small it is but um, there's three of them in it. Great deal, I think. Now here's, I buy this all the time. It's Dermacil Labs uh, Cocoa Butter Lotion. And um, it's a moisturizing body lotion, eight full ounce. And I love this. I mean, it works on not only soothing and um, like if you have a dry spot, you put it, you keep putting it on for a couple days, and um, it goes away. Um, it helps with stretch marks. Um, I've had three children, and I'm not bragging, but the stretch marks that I do have are barely visible, and um, it's all from this so um, if you ever see it I would um, go ahead and pick one up just to try and I guarantee if you love coconut butter and moisturizing body lotions and then with the extra that helps relieve all the things I told you and I'm sure it does more too uh, you'll love this and I have, this is personal care. It says compare to um, skin tummates moisturizing shave gel. This is a moisturizing shave gel, sensitive, silky, smooth, raspberry, 
with uh, vitamin E and alloy and it's a net weight of five ounces and I buy this there all the time I love it and um, it works I've, I've, this has probably been the third year that I've been using this and I just love it and I also buy bought buy <laughs> This says, compared to edge shave gel sensitive skin. Um, it's called Assured Smooth Glide save, Shave Gel. Can't talk to that. <laughs> sensitive skin and alloy enriched. And it's a five ounce too. I figured I'd try this one. And if not me, then... Um, my husband or my son can use it. And I also bought some Great Sense Air Freshener Sparkling Cranberry 5-in-1. And it is a 10-ounce can. And it smells good. I love it. Okay. I should have saved that to do the other things like that. But I had it. I had it sitting here, so I just picked it up. Now, they have these, um, April, ba see, April bath and shower. It's a wooden bath brush. The handle is real wood instead of that plastic that they normally carry. And, um, they, I, I no, normally I'll pick like a lavender out or, uh, something like that, but they only had two of these. And uh, it was this light, light pink. And I, I think I'm going to really love it. I'll, um, a lot of these things, let me know if you would like for me to do a, a test and then on, on some of the products and make a video letting y'all know what my opinion is, if it's worth it. Um, does it work? Does it, uh, you know, look good? on because uh, um, I'll show you with some of the other stuff just uh, just my opinion on it let, let me know down in the comments okay um, now the next are um, facial mask and I had to go out of town a lot of this stuff I had to go out of town to uh, to get it because my store didn't have it in that's why I'm not doing um, Easter. I, I might have did one video so far this year, but um, they don't have nothing really up except for like Easter egg, grass, the uh, uh, buckets, and none of the craft stuff that you would use, you know, to make stuff with. And, I, and when I went to Winchester, um, that's the out of town store here in Kentucky that's right up the road from where I live they didn't have that much Easter out too so I'm like well I'll just get some other stuff and uh, stretch it out because of the storm that's coming in and uh, we got a, we have another one come, supposed to be here by 1 o'clock today on Monday the 15th uh, but anyway let's get back to the haul and quit talking about the weather. <laughs> this is called Spa Life Activated Charcoal, Charcoal uh, Pore Clarifying Facial Mask and it is, it contains one treatment. This is what it looks like. And then we have, let me set that one down. This is called Broadway Beauty. I don't wonder if that's like the makeup. Um, I didn't think of that when I when I bought it. But anyway, this is Bamboo Facial Sheet Mask. Um, poor minimizing charcoal. It draws out impurities and renews skin. And there is, I believe, just one um, mask in it. And that's what it looks like. And then here... They even show you on the back how to put it on, what it looks like, and, and everything. 
And then there's this Freeman Repairing Honey Hair Mask. Well, I didn't read the hair mask. I thought this was a facial mask. But that would be good because I used to use stuff with honey on my hair before. But uh, it doesn't show you on the back. It's a 64 ounce. Um, but the directions for it is on the back. And then there's this one. It's a Spa April Bath and um, Shower. This is a two-step. Step one is a green tea facial cleanser. It removes oils, dirt, and makeup buildup. Step two is activated charcoal face mask. And it removes impurities that leave skin looking dull. So this is one and this is two. And instructions are on the back of each of them. Okay, and I have two more masks here. This is, uh, this one, it's a peel-off foil mask, let's see, and then there's three masks in here, so, um, let's see, it is, contains blue and red silver peel-off mask, but anyway, there's two in it, this is the red one. And again, here they have the instructions and little pictures for you. And then there's a, another one like it, but it is a, it's blue. So, there they are together. Now I have some makeup. This is called um, L'Oreal. It's True Match Mineral uh, makeup. It's a .35 ounce and and this is it. And here's your brush up here. And this is the powder, I believe. It's powder. And here we have a Broadway uh, color correcting face primer. And it is a Point sixty seven full ounce. But as you can see, it's um where is it? Broadway right there. And then I have some more Broadway stuff. I have um Broadway eyebrow kit. It is right here. I'm trying to get it so the glare let me see turn it that way there you go it's the let's see if I can go ahead and open it I think it's the plastic on the um, and of course it's it won't come off without scissors but anyway it's it has this like a a gel thing right here and then it has brown and black and right here it shows you on the back how to do it there's your instructions can't believe this a dollar um, at the Dollar Tree because because this these things cost um, a lot more at these at other stores. Now this one is called Broadway Colors Contour Artist Powder. And here's these. And again on the back it shows you you know where to put the each color and um some of them are sparkle, but uh, you can't beat this for a dollar. And then this is Broadway Colors Contour Artist Cream. And there they are. 
and let me see. Yes, it shows you on the back where to put uh, each one. And let's see, this is the last of the Broadway. This is called Broadway Colors Eyeshadow Kit. Look at all them colors in there. And it's a nice size. See, it fits right. I've, I have a small hand. I mean, uh, it's like a petite hand. But you can, you can see how big it is. And compared to... I can pick it up. Compared to the other ones, you can you can see. Okay, now I have two products of matte. This is a lip gloss. Let me see if I can get this one off. I'm going to start bringing my scissors to these hauls, and I'm going to start opening up products to um, show you what they look like. Well, well now it's got a... Um, plastic wrapped all around it. I'm just going to try this for a few seconds to see if I can get it open. And if not, I'm going to go on. But this is called Juliet number 09. And the color is this right here. Okay, it, it can't come off. I'm sorry. I got myself all excited thinking. And this is a, a matte lip lacquer. That's what they're called, lip lacquers. And this one is a light pink compared to this one. These were the only colors they had. And now this is a Wet n Wild um, gel lip liner, and it is um, I Get the Juice, and it's E663D, and this is sealed in a plastic container too. Oh, I can get it open down here. Yay! I'm trying to get it out of the... There's a, a thing in it right there. It goes all the way up. And that's what your lip liner is in. I got it. Okay, this is the color right here, but I'm going to try to see. Oh, good. It doesn't have that plastic on it. And let's do a swatch. There it is. I think it's beautiful. That'll look good um, with a lot of different lipstick shades that I have. And then, I tried to get the plastic off this here, but what it is, this end here is the lid to this. And this is eyeliner. And it, it's uh, like a silver, and it has sparkles in it. It's glitter, can you see that? And it's just like this right here, but not as much. And there's a sharpener right here. But without scissors, 
I can't get this plastic that they wrapped. I don't know why they did that, wrapped it up in. But I thought I'd try this out. And then there is Maybelline New York um, Snap Car Carla Carre. It's a smooth, clump-free volume. Um, mascara. It's number 320 uh, Black Cherry. Now all they had was the Black Cherry and purple. And um, I used to, when I was younger, I'd wear like purples and, and different colors, but I thought I'd try the Black Cherry and see here it is. That came out real easy. This is what what it looks like here. And then, huh, on the side, it has all these little eyes. Let's see. On this side is a is the okay, never mind. I don't know what I was thinking because it looks like this on this side and then this on this and I'm used to them having like two things but this is the mascara let me put some this is what it looks like on the bottom here so I think I like that and th this is a pretty good size uh, container which is 34 full ounce. And I only have three more makeup items. This is a Maybelline um, highlighting concealer. It's, it's dark, profound, number 70. And it's Maybelline. And it's just um, concealer. I thought I'd try that because we all know that these cost a lot more than a dollar. So, on all these products, if, if you buy it, get it home, use it, decide you don't like it, at least you've only spent a, a dollar instead of $10 to $15 if, if you've got it somewhere else. Now, here's an eyeshadow uh, brush by Sassy and Chick. Now, I previously, um, a while back, I, I bought a, a lot of these different brushes, but they didn't have this one. It's real thin, and uh, they didn't have this one, so I decided to go ahead and get it. And there's another one I'm looking for. It's a uh, real, it's real uh, flat, and it spreads out. And, um, I can't find it anywhere. But hopefully, hopefully I'll be able to find it next time I go to. I know they probably won't get it up here at mine, at my uh, Dollar Tree in Paris, Kentucky. So I'll probably have to try Winchester or Lexington. Anyway, now, this is a lip liner pencil, number 1902. It's a .04 ounce, and it's by e.l.f. And, let's see. Let me take it out. It has something on the side. I think it's a pencil sharpener. Give me a second. I just have to pop this thing. What I do, did was just push my thumbnail right down in it and if you ever have problems um sometimes it might work sometimes it don't depends on how thick and hard the paper is okay this is the color right here now this Is it's, it's the lid and the um, 
a sharpener all in one, but the way it's made, because sometimes maybe the once you uh, sharpen it, the stuff uh, might stay up in there, and uh, I'm thinking use whatever you use on your other ones and, and sharpen it then. But this is the lip liner right here on the bottom. And that's the other lip liner that I showed Jim's before. But I love e.l.f. products. And that's the only thing I've seen. Except for, um, they had some concealer. But it was in real light. And it would make me look like a ghost or, or something. Okay. Next, I have this, um, it's from Global Beauty Care. And it's cleansing cloths, and you get 30 of them in here, and they work. I buy these there all the time. And there's not much left, y'all. These are three pair of women's athletic no-show socks, uh, size 5 to 9. And I got um, these with the... As you can see, they're no so no show socks. It has light green there and on the heel and the toes. The other one is like a lilac. And then the other one is like a darker pink. And then I've got the ultra light low cut socks. And there's um only two pair in this one, but it, it's it's still a good deal. And these are gray with um, like an orange. And then the other one is just solid gray. Okay, now that's it on that. Now for some cleaning supplies, etc. Um, this is a pet bow. As y'all know, if you've watched any of my previous videos, um, couple months ago we rescued three kittens and we finally found these here they're easier to clean because they're um, metal and um, it's now with a new non-skid base so like on the bottom here it, going around is rubber so it won't slide all over the place so we got three of them I picked up some more of this Brillo basis dish portion but this time I got it in the lavender because the, the last one that I got I can't remember the scent but I didn't like it um, it was too strong and but uh, this lavender smells real good, so I'm really going to like doing the dishes with these. I got some more of this powdered bleach, color safe for um, dark colors. It's in citrus scent. Now, this is a 24-ounce bottle. What am I talking about? Box. <laughs> bottle. Okay, and from using this, I've been using this for years. Um, and it works every time. And I picked up some of this, the Home Store Non-Abrasive Bathroom Cleaner. Powerful foaming action, cleans and removes soap stains. It is a fast and easy cleanup of tubs, toilets, showers, sinks, basins, and more. And it is a 13 ounce, but you don't really have to use, this lasts a long time. You don't have to use a lot. You just spray it on. You, you wait until it's done. I, I normally wait mm, 10, 15 minutes, and I'm, I go do something else. And it, it really works. I bought some more of this um, um contact paper from Q QC and this is a white background with black flowers 
going all the way around. I picked up two more of these um, poster stickers. There's 50 cents. 50 cents. <laughs> oh, goodness. 56 on uh, each piece, on each one, front and back. And here's this one. And they have other colors and other um, little you know, little different ones for smaller projects, and um, they have the stencils and stuff there, too. This says uh, Dream Big, and it is a just a little composition book. Like, you could use it for your journal, your uh, diary, anything. And um, as you can see, it's got a lot of sheets of paper in there. And actual name brand Reynolds Wrap. You cannot beat this for a dollar. It is 6 yards by 12 inches. 18 square feet. Look at that. I should have bought more and put them in the, in the uh, pantry. Okay. The last two items, and if if you are a subscriber and you watch all my videos, you know every time I go, I have to get pretzels because I love the stick pretzels. And this time, I couldn't find any, so I asked them if they had any. Um, it's called uh, Home Style Select French, uh, French Onion Dip, and it is an 85 ounce. I haven't tried it yet, but again, if you all want me to use some of these uh, products and start uh, doing a review on it, making like say for Friday or um, Saturday or Sunday, whatever day I'll do it on and do like a product review, Thelma's product review or something like that I'd make as the title. Just leave it, leave it in the comments below, and I'll start doing that. All right, I want to thank you all for stopping by and checking out my channel. I hope you all enjoyed it and found some goodies. And um, don't forget to hit that like button. It really helps my channel out. Um, share this video and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to hit that little bell right next to it. That way you won't miss any more of my future uploads here on YouTube. And I would really love to have you as part of my family here on YouTube. And um, I am already have a, um, a Facebook page. And I'm thinking of, op of opening another for um, arts and crafts. Just let me know in the comments if you think I should. And I've got one of those, um, I can't think of the name of it, Instagram. Um, but I'm figuring out how to work it. I don't, I don't know what I'm doing in it. I've never, I'm really not, I've had to have my daughter show me how to do everything. But, except for here on YouTube, it's pretty easy, you, you know. But anyway, I hope you all have a safe and happy day. And uh, until next time, bye.